This is the Pritikin Museum, the largest private estate in San Francisco with a collection of fine art, sculpture, and San Francisco memorabilia with an estimated value of some $40 million. This grand estate, located in the geographic center of San Francisco, offers drop-dead views of some 10 neighborhoods and the famous Bay Bridge. The sprawling gardens, actually a private park, include a waterfall, a babbling brook, fountains, and a 20-foot bronze tree whose branches spew fire and water. The manicured grounds are populated with a zoo of life-sized bronze animals. And the exterior walls of the Grand Mansion display a breathtaking mural of some 75 famous and infamous San Franciscans past and present. Say hello to Janis Joplin, Joe DiMaggio and Marilyn Monroe, Philo Fonsworth, who invented television in San Francisco. Yes, we even included the notorious Zodiac Killer. I left my heart. Now, if you left your heart in San Francisco, maybe this is it, a 10-foot golden heart. Shall we go inside? Of course, you've heard of San Francisco's famous sculptor, Benimino Bufano. You are now in the Bufano Gallery, where many of his monumental works, carved in marble, are on display. This is probably San Francisco's most famous sign, formerly on the exterior facade of the famed North Beach restaurant, Moose's. Talk about memories of yesteryear. This yesteryear memory is only a few years ago. Remember the fabled toy store, F.A.O. Schwartz, in downtown San Francisco? Here at the Pritikin Museum is that grand clock that would welcome your visit to the fabulous store. Shall we ascend the grand staircase and view some of the world's great paintings? This portrait of Prince Philip, the consort to the Queen of England, was intended for the walls of Buckingham Palace. But the prince, after four sittings, promptly rejected it. He failed to understand the metaphoric significance of this blue bottle fly on his shoulder and the plant growing out of his index finger. London's Tate Museum would surely enjoy a gift of this JMW Turner. You know, the last Turner sold at auction for more than $30 million. On your small private tour, perhaps your draws will drop most when you stand before Rembrandt's Night Watch painting. This so-called replica was commissioned by the Lord Mayor of Amsterdam to serve as a substitute for the original and kind of a decoy in the Reich Museum when the Nazis were plundering some of the great art of Europe. And this global horror Hitler's personal world globe, completely authenticated with the inscription, May the Bastard Rot in Hell. You know, the Pritikin Museum is not without its double dose of whimsy. Among the thousands of artifacts and odd effects are this, the world's smallest painting. This sculpture of the iconic Transamerica building constructed with hundreds of condom boxes, the artists protest against his presumption of corporate neglect to the tragic AIDS epidemic. The magic bunnies, 
a giant M&M. Some of the highlight of your visit will include an introduction to some very real people who aren't really real at all. They are creations of the internationally famed sculptor Mark Sijan. Meet this sad lady who lives on our streets. And these ladies who were married in San Francisco City Hall, which spawned hundreds of same-sex marriages throughout the world. And finally, say hello to Mark Sijan, a self-image of the sculptor himself, who was guarding the incomparable collection of fine art displayed at the Whitaker Museum. There's much eye candy in the Pritikin Museum. Three grand pianos. One of them very grand indeed. You might just enjoy a repast by the second floor swimming pool with its vaulting cathedral windows and sliding glass roof. The Mayor's Gallery is where San Francisco political icons, including Mayor Sonny Jim Rolfe, former Mayors Joe Aliotto, Frank Jordan, and Willie Brown are on display. Former Mayor Brown had this to say, Bob Pritikin's museum is what San Francisco is all about. More than 10,000 items of breathtaking beauty and historic significance are here for the fascination and entertainment of just a few select guests. How can you visit this only in San Francisco museum? Well, it may not be so easy. If you're a senior, perhaps you'll be in one of the limited private senior tours. Or if you're active in community causes, such as fundraising for the ballet or the Sierra Club, maybe you'll join the party. But remember, the Pritikin Museum is not open to tour buses, and tickets are not sold to the public at the door. This not-for-profit museum is only available with advanced private reservations to small pre-approved community groups. Find out more by calling area code 415-824-4458 or emailing us at pritikinmuseum at yahoo.com. Dot com.